All right, there's only one of him, boys. But he's no ordinary kid. And he'll see no mercy today! Yeah! It looks like the rumors were true, Keto. Yep. But what's going on? Why would one kid just walk into that? It's suicide. Try zipping it up, rookie. Hmm? Oh. Let's give this kid a beating his grandkids will feel! Yeah! Kitazawa. Huh? NATO, it's you! Now that you're here, we're unbeatable! What's the deal with the big turnout? All these fellas to fight one measly kid? NATO, I thank you for coming, but please just don't ask any questions, okay? I beg you! Hmm. What are you so scared of? Please, NATO, no! Get up, he's here! <gasps> there, there he is! alone. That punk must think he's something special. Yeah! Bucky! You afraid to bring it over that fence? Look at him. He's nothing but a runt. like they were nothing. Mentally, he's got more going on than those who'd resort to things like knives and swords. And here's the kicker. Half of those chumps are ready to split, but the other half aren't sure. You don't scare us, Carrot Top. If you hadn't noticed, there's a hundred of us. Against just little old you. <laughs> Why are you laughing at me? Four. Speak up if you're talking to me. You're only as tough as four men. Four what? Four men? What does he mean? The idiot's gonna fight all of them. Man, he's tough. Then let's them all at once. He knows that only four people can come at him at once. Smart kid there. There's a hundred of them. That's 25 separate fights. He can't... Uh, excuse me. Try to stop them. I got enough false teeth, but thanks. Oh, come on. <laughs> Time to shut this 
party down. What? What? All right, ladies, this party's over. Holy crap, it's Keto! I'm out of here! It's past your bedtime, kid. Get home before your mama starts worrying. You're just gonna let them go? Wake up, Bucky. Huh? Oh, it's just you. Keto! Don't move! You're under arrest for assaulting an officer, huh? Uh. Another dentist appointment. I'm sick of dishing out money to that bloodsucker. Keto, are you okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. Better than these guys. Well, Bucky, out of a hundred, looks like you laid out about... Uh... Thirty-seven of them. Yes. Out of an estimated one hundred, but there could have been more. Well, yes, until the police intervened. Good work. Now go find the next one. A loss is still a loss, Bucky. <laughs> Man, only 37? I was really pulling for 50. <sighs> I thought I was doing them over pretty good up until the end. You sure you want to let him go? He did knock out one of your teeth. Maybe you want to lose some teeth too, huh? Just trying to help. Yeah. You guys want to stop following me? No can do. Some of those guys might still be lurking around in some of these shadows. Besides, Sly here has just joined up with the juvenile division, trying to show him the ropes. Learning about you and your kind is part of the job. Yeah, whatever. You know, you're a really tough kid. Yeah, thanks for noticing. Ibaka here is feared by every low-life punk in this town. He's somewhat of a legend. But don't take my word for it. You'll see. Huh? What is all this? Oh. They know they can't beat him, so they have to resort to vandalism. It's really the only place they can hit him. All this graffiti everywhere. Isn't this kind of thing a problem for the neighborhood or his parents? He's here alone. Nobody lives out here, not even his parents. He doesn't have parents? He does. They just don't live anywhere around here. Do you ever stop talking? <laughs> Sorry, kid. Pick up your cigarette, please. <laughs> See what I mean? That's Bucky Hanma. If you ever hear about any kind of fighting in this town, you can be sure Bucky's part of it somehow. Nastiest thugs in town are after him. The kind of guys that can break a man in half. And Bucky's just 13 years old. 13? Yeah. Today wouldn't have taken my dad one minute. Like that one time, a long time ago. I can't do it. I can't ever hope to be as good as my father.
We've been expecting you. Hmm. It looks like you've been hurt. Just let it go. I hate to tell you this, but you shouldn't be fighting while you're still training. If you want to be a high-caliber fighter, then you just... Just shut up! You're not in the mood. I see. Well then, let's just move right into today's program. your breath, Baki, and then we'll move on to the next activity in today's program. No, we won't. And just what do you mean by that? Uh, uh, I'm finished with all you stupid loudmouth coaches! You're not thinking straight. If you continue to follow our instructions, your strength could be immeasurable. Uh, oh. Immeasurable strength? Uh. Baki, oh. stop that! Same jump 50 times a day! None of it's making me any stronger! Hold him tight! I am! Hold him tighter! Uh, no! This is a waste! So this! It's all worthless! Worthless! Every second of training is worthless if I can't beat a measly hundred guys! I'm done. Done with you guys once and for all. Got it? From here on out, I'm gonna do things my way. Akazawa residence, how can I help you? Oh, hello, coach. Baki did what? Sounds like my boy is outgrowing himself. Here is the one million as promised. Please accept our thanks. Sorry, but I just don't think one million is gonna be nearly enough, Kurogawa. Almost half of us were left unconscious and bleeding. Kirizawa, you were hired to beat Baki, not get caught during the process. As compensation, I have paid you the price you agreed upon before you lifted a finger. I want more. Need I remind you, any physical damage you may have received is irrelevant to our previous agreement. Oh, yeah? Then maybe I should take this up with your bosses at the company. How about that? See what they say when I tell them that you hired me to beat up a 13-year-old kid. Well, speak up. I can't hear you. Sir, please keep it down. Mind your own business. You're dead, old man. Come here. It's rude to point a blade. I apologize! Well, now, we all make mistakes. I want so desperately to get stronger. I want to be the strongest grappler in the world. Just like my father. I'm never going to get there if I keep doing the same things. Oh man, what am I going to do? I don't have the brain power to handle this. Strongest gangster around? Now, why would the great Akizawa group need to know something like that? Do you have any idea just how many of them there are out there? Really? 
I realize how absurd this must sound to you, especially given that you're retired, but I was hoping that you could be giving enough to provide me with at least some assistance. Times may have changed, but if all is working properly, this is still a business of aggression. We cannot afford a moment of weakness. In all the trades of our world, there are always one or two who are considered truly gifted. The fighting world is no exception. If you want a bare knuckles fighter, you want Koru. Koru it is. What the? Good one, Genoi! Show him what the knee is made of! Because you're a bit young. Mu Tai, huh? What's that all about? You know? That's cool. That's Yuri Tchaikovsky, the international welterweight champ. Yuri Tchaikovsky? He might just be a welter, but his goal is to be the undisputed world champion. Only he's so strong, no one will spar with him anymore. So we had to bring Thailand's Mu Tai style champ over to practice. However, it doesn't look like much of a challenge out there. Don't forget to use your legs! Koru Hanoyama is the current boss of the Hanoyama gang. He inherited the leadership of the group when his father, the previous leader, died under questionable circumstances. Upon his ascension, Koru started a vengeance war with Kobe's vicious Tomizawa group. He began this war by using only his bare hands to destroy the Tomazawa group's armed faction of over 50 men. Impressive. Thirty minutes was all it took for this 15-year-old boy to obliterate an entire gang of men with decades more fighting experience. He's 15? Koru visited here two years ago and left that behind as a souvenir for me. He is truly a gifted young man. Bring on the pain! What an uppercut! I didn't even see that one coming! He's quick. <sighs> that had to hurt. It's over. Dinoy, wake up, Dinoy! Oh! Nice job, Yuri. Now on to the next program, I think. Ah! Now, who is that young lad? Uh, it's not that. <laughs> Yuri Tchaikovsky, if I'm not mistaken. Think you can go a few more rounds?
to fulfill the ideology of such classic ideals as these. Baki himself has drawn battle lines that he has had to cross. But this inner awakening has also set free a surrounding darkness in the world. And it is this ferocious fang that Baki, the grappler, will have to face alone. On the next episode...